Feel the heat. Feel the feel the Bitcoin power heat. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hi, I'm Christian. I'm here in Bitcoin Bath House in downtown New York City. We're talking about 5,000 tiles a day. We're talking about 1,200 clients a day. And we're talking about Bitcoin mining heat wheels. Let's see it happen. Before we get into everything else, what is a bathhouse? Okay, so a bathhouse is really simple. They've been around for 5,000 years across all geographies and cultures, um, different variations, but same theme. But basically it's uh, a bunch of different temperature pools and uh, a bunch of hot rooms and um, it's good for your health, it's fun. Very different from a spa culturally mm -hmm. in the sense that bathhouses are social places, they're neighborhood hangouts. Um, so at this location, we can do uh, about 1,100 people a day, 1,100 guests a day on a busy day. We have 200 employees, mm -hmm. right around 200 employees. Half of those are um, practitioners, so they're mm -hmm. massage therapists or estheticians. So yeah, about the Bitcoin, there's a copy, uh, several copies of the Bitcoin standard uh, yeah. in the lobby. Uh, could you first go, why Bitcoin? Um, what's your origin story there? Okay, why Bitcoin? So I, um, per, my Bitcoin journey was I found out about it in around 2012, I was really aware of it. I already sort of understood the problems with central banking and fiat currency, um, but I never had a reason to like do it now mm -hmm. kind of thing. Um, I was investing in my own businesses. I was investing in uh, like real estate projects and that kind of stuff, but I appreciate what it was. It had been, um, let's say a fan from the, from the yeah. sidelines. And then, um, you know, we had just opened the Williamsburg location four months before the lockdowns happened. Oh, yeah. We were baby, brand new, so everybody's gonna be out of work. They're gonna run out of money in two weeks when they, they, they miss their first paycheck. And they're gonna print money. Yep. Um, and they're gonna print a shitload of money. They're gonna print more money than they ever printed ever. And so we're gonna see massive inflation. Um, so I started looking, really looking at Bitcoin um, to consider allocating into it in a serious way. Mm -hmm. And also I started understanding the miners and, and um, they need to get rid of a lot of heat. Mm -hmm. they're, li they're literally trying to figure out the most efficient way to dump heat. Mm -hmm. I just said, well, we we buy heat. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> if, you're, if, you, if you come to bathhouse, you're sitting you're sitting in pools of heat, mm -hmm. you know, um, and that is energy. Yeah. So it, it became uh, uh, like pretty interesting. Can we um, insert a miner between the wall where we pull power out of the wall? and it hits the pools. The way I was thinking about it, like very really simple was, I replaced my electric pool heaters one for one in terms of wattage. I had 18,000 uh, watt pool heater, electric pool heaters, ripped them out. I bought 18,000 watt, this is per pool, mm -hmm. bought 18,000 watts worth of miners, put them in immersion tanks, and then I created a little hot water loop. It's all stuff you can get from Home Depot. It's nothing complicated. You know, heat exchangers I got for 400 bucks, a little pump. And um, totally works. It worked right away. Very simple. Um, so then we said, okay, we're going to do this in every bathhouse we build. We want to build bathhouses around the country. Well, one, one thing I would, I would add is like, so the pools were like the easy target, right? Mm -hmm. They're very easy. If you are at home and you have backyard pools, super easy to do. You can do it, um, especially if you don't have like super high volume pools. You can do this in your backyard, really easy. Aside from the miners and stuff, it's probably a thousand dollars of the parts. Mm -hmm. What's your guys' mining stack? Yeah, good question. So here, so for the pools, we're running uh, 14 S19 hydros at 184 terahash each, and that those are getting you know those are those are great because they're um, already water for water for water. I don't have to do immersion for them, so they're getting uh, water on the cooling side in at about 100 to 101 degrees, and they're spitting out 110 degree uh, water. And that difference is all we need to, is the, to get the pools where you need them. Mm -hmm. um, and then for the hammams, we're, uh, we're doing uh, an immersion tank with, um, I think we have, right now we have eight um, S19, X, or we have uh, XPs. Mm -hmm. um, they're like 140 terahash each. Mm -hmm. And uh, all of them, we're, uh, so, so we're using Brains uh, mining pool. And we're also uh, putting brains firmware on all the compatible units. Mm -hmm. One final question here. Uh, how would you describe this bathhouse in one word? Ooh. Hot. 
<laughs> yeah. One word, that's a hard one, man.